Welcome to AmeenAcademy.com In Fluid Mechanics regarding oscillation or rolling of ship, we'll do solving problems. Look at this example. The least radius of gyration of a ship is 8.5 meter and metacentric height is 75 centimeter. Calculate the time period of oscillation of the ship. So, least radius of gyration k equal 8.5 meter the metacentric height GM equal 75 centimeter which is equal 0 0.75 meter the time period of oscillation time period of oscillation is given T equal 2 pi k square over gm into g which is equal 2 pi square root of 8.5 square gm is uh, 0.75 into g is 9.81 therefore time period equal by calculating this we will get 19.68 seconds now let us do next question example the time period of rolling of a ship of weight 30,000 kilonewton in sea water is 12 seconds. The center of buoyancy of the ship is 1.4 meter below the center of gravity. Find the radius of gyration of the ship if the moment of energy of the ship at the water line about force 4 and half axis is 10,000 meter power 4 take the specific water specific weight of water sea water is 10,120 Newton per meter cube sea water now time period T is uh, 12 seconds then moment bg the distance between buoyancy and center of gravity bg equal 1.4 meter the moment of inertia i is given 10000 meter power 4 weight w equal 30,000 kilo Newton into 1,000 Newton. Let radius of gyration let radius of gyration equal K now first calculate metacentric height meta metacentric height uh, gm is 
data centric guide gm we will find first therefore gm equal bm minus bg that is we know that it is by formula we have one partial volume that is 1 minus v over bg now here not 1 it is i over we will calculate where i equal moment of inertia moment of inertia which is given 10,000 meter for 4 and we will calculate V is weight of ship over specific weight of sea water. equal weight of ship is 30,000 into 1000 over specific weight of uh, sea water is 10 120 10 120 is meter cube so equal to nine six four point four meter cube now we'll call clay GM equal I over V minus BG. Now here I is 10,000 over V is 2964.4 minus 1.4 that is BG is given 1.4. Now here 10,000 over 2964.4 is 3.373 minus 1.4 which is equal 1.973 meter. Now we have the formula for time period is uh, T equal 2 pi root of K squared over gm into g from that we will get t over 2 pi equal root of k square is k over square root of gm into g which gives radius of gyration k is 3 into square root of gm into g over 2 pi. Now let us apply the values. Given values k equal 12 over 2 pi into that is t 12 over 2 pi into square root of gm is 1.973 you got gm here into 9.81 we have the radius of gyration is 8.41 meter you have done Please subscribe our YouTube channel.